It's your boy, my hack loading on my smoking and talking about continuously token coming at you with another Tom McDonald. Another Tom McDonald. Another one. <laughs> but look, I really enjoyed this dude. We did the uh politically incorrect by him. And the dude's a very conscious dude, man. He's a, he's got a lot of little not a lot. I haven't heard a whole lot yet, but that song definitely made me want to go find some more stuff. And y'all keep throwing some suggestions. And this was one that I saw by him from y'all that was like, yo, please do this song because it's dope. And I'm just like, you know what? I love y'all. And y'all have great taste in music. So let's listen to this. Dear Rappers by Tom McDonald. I love you. Spark up, dab up, vape up, dip up, I don't, I don't, drink up. Whatever you got to do, just go up. Have a good time. Man, it's easy for these rappers who have it all. Talk about the days when they used to be sad. I guess I can't relate to being famous and wealthy. I'm 28 and still praying for the day I have a chance. Maybe y'all can help me out. Man, I'm that's just trying fact. to take care of my household. I don't even want to make my mouth go. I just want to win before the system that I'm in gets a hold of me again and starts to squeeze under my chin until I'm out cold. Ooh. Dear rappers, can you help me? I'll even take a selfie with your album that I bought. I got every single CD that you ever fucking dropped. I spent everything I had and I never had a lot. Oh my God, what a mess. Your words help me deal with the stress. You to contemplate my suicide the nights I was depressed used to pop you in a boombox and sit up on my desk listen to your music till I felt it in my chest but these days it's like you don't have nothing left your music feels kind of like you're trying to write a check everything is digital I mean no disrespect but I'm paying even more and you give me even less what the fuck uh. you taught me to think you taught me to grow you taught me to things to survive on my own but now you teach me to drink you teach me to smoke you teach me to think everyone look just to, uh, sorry to pause it but look I really like what he's saying right now. Look, I've, I've said it in many of videos. Music is like life for so many of us because it can put you in whatever mood you want. Whatever mood you're feeling, you can get out of that mood and into another mood just by putting a song on. It's fucking amazing. All right, let's get back into this. I'm sorry. I don't want your Xanax bars or your fancy foreign cars. Nope, I just want some money in my face and try to tell And y'all, I love y'all. No, 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 let's keep this going and growing, baby. Good vibes. No, 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 oh, wait, no, I almost fucked that up. Yeah, <laughs> just a drug addict. TV. I can't hear another fucking song about abusing medication not, that I had to take just to stay alive. There's more important shit than what you wear and where you live and who you fucking, what you drink and what you spend and what you drive. Rappers Facts. Fuck bullshit. Rappers Bars. Are marketing vehicle for the product that the man wants you to buy. Rap about a full clip. Rappers just promoting different liquors and varieties of ways that you could die. Yeah. Dear rappers, can you help me? Are you almost out of alcohol to sell me? Tell me. Cause drinking every night can be the way to getting wealthy. If I'm really being honest, all the shit is overwhelming. I need someone to look up to. You're living in a country that elected Donald Trump. You're living in a country where police are killing people every day. And all you want to talk about is doing drugs. You've been blinded by the money. You've been blinded by the cars. You've been blinded by the women. Don't Bars. know who the fuck you are. Facts. Facts. When I spend dollars on a ticket to your show. And now I feel like you stole my fucking money and I'm broke. Man, he taught us how to rap. And you taught us how to dress. And you taught us how to act if we wanted to impress now you're teaching me to live like i know you never would what you're preaching to these kids is keeping them inside the hood your bars, all your fancy foreign cars throw your money in my face and try to tell me that it's <laughs> that's like coming at so many rappers necks right now so many of y'all need to look yourselves in the face and be like am i really spitting for the you Just gonna say that. Just a drug addict on TV. Dang, that's crazy. That's dope. That's dope. And I really, I really enjoy that. And look, and, and I know some people are gonna sit there and be like, well, hi, you're so contradicting. You're sitting there smoking weed in every video. Blah blah. All you do is get high. You know what? I don't care. This right here is just a lifestyle that I choose to enjoy. 
You know what I'm saying? This is just an indulgence of my life. And I don't care how you feel about it. Because at the end of the day, you can't deny that what I'm doing right now is very positive. You know what I'm saying? I'm not condoning anybody under the age of 21 to get high and smoke weed or drink or do any sort of drug or alcohol or, or nothing like that. Be of age, be responsible. That That's a given, that's common sense. And I'm hoping that everyone that comes to this channel has that. And I'm going to assume that we have that. So let's get past that, all right? Now let's get down to the core of the real situation of what I was talking about. What I'm doing and what we're doing as a family and all the new people that we're reaching out to is creating a positive, great vibe place for people to just come and enjoy themselves. It's all about living life high. It's all about being honest, intelligent, genuine, and humble. Nothing else. It doesn't matter your views, your opinions. It doesn't matter what you look like. It doesn't matter what you refer to yourself as. I don't care. We don't care. You want to know why? Because at the end of the day, like I've always said, when the aliens come to this planet, we all going to reunite as goddamn humans like we should have in the first place. Because you want to know some real shit? When you want to sit here and talk about white and black and all this crazy stuff, it you know what? I'm not even going to get into that because he was mo most of what he was talking about was drugs and y'all promoting negative things. So we're going to stick to that. All right. And like I said, I don't promote the use of any sort of drug unless you are of age. And that's a common sense thing to have and to know. <laughs> Always remember to live your life high, man. Honest, intelligent, genuine, humble. Look yourself in the mirror and ask you living that way. Peace.